all shivers. We can't get a can of baked beans because it's going to be too heavy. Yeah. Okay. Situation. Morning. Morning. Nice and cold, isn't it? It's seven o'clock in the morning. <laughs> and we're going to get our car weighed today. Yeah. Oh, birds. Yeah. All right. Okay, I'm more awake than I am, I think. Yeah, yeah. Considering we used to get up at 3 o'clock in the morning, this, <laughs> this is a sleep in, but we're not used to it. So, it. Yeah. And it is, it is Victoria, it's Melbourne, it's, it's cold. It's freezing. Yeah. It's freezing at yeah. the moment. Yeah. So, anyway. all right. Yeah, gotta head north to yeah. warm my weather. <laughs> G'day, I'm Dave from Down Under Wayne. We're out here Wayne and Gil and Joy's van today. You can find out if they're compliant on their on their car on their van and figure out their weights these are weigh a few kilos your plates uh, <laughs> so when you weigh yourself do you weigh <laughs> yeah we just add it add it <laughs> add that in it's about 100 kilos for the whole Bobs. Mm -hmm. I've warmed up a little bit. Yeah, I've, I've got cold. Look at the mist over there. Like it is yeah, I know. Colder before the sunrise. Yeah, it's cold. Well, you might as well clean the whole van, Gil, while you're at it. Give it a good clean. You got rid of the bed, Poopy? Uh, no, are you, you're going to be travelling doing your failure? Yeah, yeah. Take it with you on the road, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. <coughs> yeah. Um, I'm going to get you to drive up. You, buy, you guys are both going to sit in there. You can stay out and record it if you want. Um, film and get on the scales. Yeah. We're going to take your weights. You both jump in so we can okay. get a more accurate reading of where's what. Yep. Yep. All right. We're hopping in at the same time so he doesn't know the difference in who weighs what, okay? <laughs> Watch him. Yeah, got the caravan on the scales. This is the, the high-tech stuff. Yeah. Good bloody views. So you got eight, 877, 952, 845, 961. So we're a little bit heavier on the driver's side. Yeah, that's why the uh, airbags are compensating. Yeah. Uh, all right. But nothing we can't fix. So we're doing the tow ball weight now. And what have we got? The uh, tow ball weight, 280, is it? Yeah. Is that, um, that's a, what percentage is that? Oh, we have to wait, wait till the caravan's way, don't we? Um, you, you're sitting at uh, about 7%. So. 7%, which is just okay, isn't it? Yep. Mm -hmm. I'd, I'd be between 6 and 10. Or, 6 and yep. Um, yeah. So you've got about 120 to play with, which is good. You want that room anyway, because you've got your firebox on top. So, you, you know, once you start carrying your firewood, you can yeah. add to that weight, but then yeah. you've got enough room. So, we'll have a look in your van. I wouldn't mind shifting a little bit of weight. Maybe over this third wheel here where it says 817. Okay, so it's, which, one, even, which wheel is that? That's back left, where the door is. Oh, okay. oh back on the other side? Yeah. They're always a little bit lighter. Because the door is there. It's hard to find weight to put on that. Oh, handbrake. I'll yeah, you might want to take your handbrake off, Dave. Yeah. Not drive with your handbrake on. Um, Dave said I'm not the only one to do it. It's very common. It's very common. Because I got back and I went to him, did you put the handbrake on? He goes, no. <laughs> did you? I'm, and I pretty, went, I'm 90% no. sure I drove. With it on? Yeah. With it on. <coughs> no, no, I'm, yeah, not 100, I'm 90% sure I did. But, I suppose you might have just automatically just pulled the handbrake I on and not uh, yeah, thought I about think, it. I think I drove with it on. Yeah. <laughs> As I say, there was sunny. Did you kick yourself enough about it though? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I did that for a while. 
I don't think I'll do it again. All right, so I've right. got your report here. We'll take you through it. The way we read this, this is just the vehicle by itself, the way it sits without the caravan hooked up, so it's yep. unhitched. So we got 875, 889, 973, 963. The way the vehicle sits, she's pretty well weighted. We'll come down into the report. We've got manufactured specs up the top, measured weight in the middle, available load down the bottom, green good, red bad. So your GBM, how much you can have in your car, you've still got 300 kilos that you can put in the car. But keep in mind, the tow ball weight of the caravan goes onto the car's GVM. GCM, we'll get into that as we come down to combined. Front axles, you've got 136 kilos left. And your rear axles, you've got 164 kilos. Your tow capacity is at four tonne because you guys have got the uh, levels upgrade. So we'll come down into your van now. So on your tow ball, you have 312. You've got 857, 940, 856, and 954. So with your van, we want to try and move some, we want to try and shift a little bit of weight over to the left, which we've tried doing a little bit of, but when you get home, you guys are going to restack and you're going to try and shift a little bit more over to the left just to give you a more level ride. And then your running gear will uh, wear more evenly for you. So come down to in, into ATM. How much your caravan can weigh when it's disconnected from the car and just sitting by itself, jockey wheel down. You guys have got full loaded water tanks and you got everything in here for living. So you guys still have 81 kilos left that you're able to put in the van when, when it sits by itself. Maybe you shouldn't have told me that. <laughs> <laughs> GTM, we'll get into that when we get down to combined. Tow ball mass, you guys have got 312 on the tow ball. So you got 88 kilos left, which is good because you've got a little bit of firewood that you can put in the top here and you're sitting at the 8% mark. Your front axles, you got 203 kilos, and your rears, you got 100. So I can still buy more stuff for the caravan, you're saying, but I can't because we've got this weight 100 here. And, what is it, about 160 kilos for the bottom area? Yeah, 180. 181. Which means food in, food out. We've just done food shopping. We've just done everything anyway. Yeah. There's more stuff in there than what we need to take, but we're taking it. Yeah. And then that way you've got, you'll figure out what you want when, yeah. you're, when you're on the road. Yeah. And start certain yeah. things. And no doubt you'll buy some stuff while you're out there. Yeah, yeah, we didn't want to have, oh, shivers, we can't get a can of baked beans because it's going to be too heavy. Yeah. Okay. Situation. What yeah, would that, safe. would be safe. Yeah, because I don't. I want to know that we're safe and we're not going to yeah. be unsafe so to anybody else. Look for these three numbers. Yeah. More than anything. All you, because you guys are only 12 kilos over in your GVM. Yeah. So we're we're going to lose that weight anyway. Yeah. <laughs> or take a couple of bottles of water out. Yeah, exactly. And, like, you're going to so drink yeah. that or drive it. to nothing. Yeah. But yeah, um, without the caravan on, what, how much weight have we got there? Yeah. 300 kilos. Yeah. So that can go in there. Kilos. Oh, oh, so, yeah, freezing again. Basically, yeah, if we're without the caravan, we can have all that stuff in there and we're not overweight. Yeah. It's yeah. Just, with the caravan on. Yeah. Puts you, puts you overweight. Just, just to wear, well, 12 kilos, which we're pretty much nothing. Oh, um, The right. only thing, I'm happy. just shift some weight to the left side yeah. of your van. Just well, this is weird because I would have thought most of the weight is on this uh, side. Because the kitchen and everything, the fridge, the kitchen is all on that side. But there's nothing over that side we can move. Um, yeah, I've, I've just played oh. around, I've just put some tin cans and stuff on the bottom where my shoes were, yeah. just to see what difference that made. But with me standing on the Thermomix. step... Thermomix over this side. Where is it? The, oh, yeah. You've got it on your side. Ah. Put it on my side of the bed. The Thermomix will weigh quite a bit. Yeah. That, That'll make how, a how much is that? Wait, well, it's... It's pretty heavy. Uh, yeah. It's got a few, quite a few kilos in it. Yeah, all those little bits and pieces kilos. that you do like that. Because yeah. I'm thinking this side's my side. Yeah. So I, it's like jam-packed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? And that side's his side. So there's not much in there. Yeah. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, she's got all the clothes. Yeah. There is quite a bit of water underneath the fridge too. Ah, yes, we've got yeah. all bottled water under yeah. the fridge. That'll yeah. go because we're not going to. We we're, just we're, had it left over from the shop. Yeah, yeah. So we kept it all, and the and the and the freezers, the fridge, and that's full of meat and stuff. Yeah, we've got we've got the fridge. Yeah, the and pack. then once you start eating all that stuff, you know, yeah. change, your waist yeah. will forever be changing up and yeah. down. But yeah, but we'll just remember to put portable stuff, stuff over this side. So the the the, the jack is fine at the back. Yeah. Oh, good. Um, is it, in your opinion, worth moving the spare wheel over? Probably not. Probably not. No. You will get I'm worried, I'm worried about the legal. Yeah. Because yeah, you've got to have yeah. 45 degree. 
view of it, don't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of the indicators. So yeah. I'm thinking. Well, some people have two. Yeah, right? leave it where it for, is. For it, to move it this far is probably yeah, like not worth it. Oh, that sounds right. And, and I'm OCD and have not having it in the middle. <laughs> we'll drive you nuts. Uh, yeah, we'll drive drive nuts. me nuts as well. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, I'll just quickly run through <laughs> these two questions and you guys can get out of here. Questions. Uh, oh, page three is your abbreviation breakdown. So when you're reading the report and you're going, what the hell does this yeah. mean? Come back to page three, yeah. refer to that. Yeah. And you're laughing. Yeah. I'll send you guys an email of this. Cool. You get a copy. Um, any questions, my number's at the bottom. I think ring. you had a yeah. spider hanging off your chin. Was that? Yeah, that's gone. Oh, Just look like there's a spider hanging there. Uh, and then, yeah, the rest is what it is. Cool. So, yeah, just your main concern is you just want to shift a little bit of weight over to the left side yep. of the band. Cool. Honestly and thought he would have said that I've got to shift some of my weight from my <laughs> side because of all the shit that I've got. Now, <laughs> when you were saying before you recommend to travel with the tanks empty, yep. maybe not in drinking water, but the other two tanks just so, so you're not dragging that extra weight. It's 300 kilos. Yes, because it's going to take from your fuel and uh, fuel's expensive as well. Um, but also, the benefit of having full water tanks is that lower centre of gravity, which is going to pull the van down towards the road more. Yeah. But then, you guys are quite heavy anyway. We're so. heavy enough anyway. Yeah. Yeah. And Speak for yourself. <laughs> our, our, our rig. We've got a head. Go, well, let's let's be let's be honest with this. And you guys are four twelve car and three six oh seven van. So the, yeah. the car's yeah. heavier than the van, which means the car will always be the leader, the van will follow, which yeah. is what you want. If which the is van's yeah. heavier than the car, the car's gonna get pushed all over yeah. the road. Mm -hmm. So right. you guys are you set up well. You got a good just, setup there, just, babe. Just, just <laughs> so I'm a bit heavy, heavy in the rear. <laughs> <laughs> so am I, but I'm not going to brag about it. <laughs> right. So you might see some of these bits on the bloopers. If you... <laughs> I think Taz we, we always try and have bloopers where we think, stuff uh, up. Yeah, I and where Gil, Gil says that I'm right, you're all, right, all you're right. Happy wife, happy life. Yeah, smart man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's but come yeah. to the signal. Like, oh yeah, I'm right. <laughs> so we need to give you some money. Oh shit! Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Um, <sighs> it's seven o'clock in the morning and oh, it's freezing and Gil's smiling. <laughs> morning, so we're, 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 here we are. Um, oh, uh, okay. No, oh, it's all right. No. <laughs> um, can we do a, like an intro? Like we've just got here, we're going to weigh the car. Do you want to do that? Introduce yourself, yeah, yeah. say who you are, yeah. and then. Um, you can give yourself a bit of a plug, like I'm going to be travelling around Australia or whatever, doing yep. doing this. So, you know, yeah, do you want to do that? Yep. No worries. Right. I don't know if I take my shirt off and have one. Have you got your logo on? Yeah. <laughs> 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 so I wondered if you want, if you want to like, misspell the year down under to start with. Yeah. No, yeah, well, because we couldn't get DOW in, so this is the closest we could get. And then we used to do repair work as well, but now we're just doing the way. So. Checking out his pecs. <laughs> <laughs> Joe's not shy. Sorry, Who I'm not shy. <laughs> um, am so, I kicking off? Yeah, uh -huh. well, you, Go for you it. know. Because I can yeah. edit. Yeah, yeah. If yeah. this stuff up, don't, uh, don't I, worry I about it. I could introduce edit. you, but we've done yeah. that. So. Yeah. Oh, I don't know how this video is going to go because I'm shaking, I'm freezing. <laughs> oh, I've, um, I don't think I've, I've warmed up from this morning. Yeah. <clears throat> that's, that's pretty